I'm Jessica for The Developer Show. This is your weekly update on the coolest developer news from Google. We've released Android 13 for TV. This latest release has improvements in performance and accessibility to help developers build engaging apps for the next generation of TVs, like the Input Device API, which now supports different keyboard layouts. And game developers can also reference keys by their physical location too. We recently shared architectural recommendations and best practices. And now we have templates that implement these recommendations. We launched a new project on GitHub with templates to get you started quickly. These templates contain opinions in the form of architectural patterns and use libraries like Room, Hilt, Material 3, and more. Check them out and send us your feedback on the included libraries and overall functionality, the customizer script, and other variants that you want to see. Have you ever wanted to give a robot instructions like make a smiley face out of blocks? You're in luck. We presented a framework for building interactive, real-time, natural language instructable robots. We have open source assets like the dataset, environment, benchmarks, and policies. The framework is called Interactive Language, and it processes large-scale imitation learning frameworks for processing real-time, open vocabulary, language conditionable robots. In other words, you can tell a robot, make a smiley face out of the blocks. To learn more about this week's stories, make sure to check out the description box below for all the links. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share, and stay safe. I'm Jessica for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. You tell me when. <laughs> yeah, when. <laughs>